Good afternoon diecast collectors, welcome back to the channel. I'm Chris from CRA Diecast. Did a little bit of, little bit of peg hunting today and I picked up quite a few new castings from Hot Wheels and I've got a, a new one from Matchbox and the three new ones or variations to existing ones from Majorette. So first up from Hot Wheels from their Hot Wheels Turbo Series is a Porsche 935 in bright red and this one is an existing one just some slight variations to it but that's a beautiful casting nice paintwork nice aero rims on the side smoked glass nice little splitter at the front and some yellow striping around the um, edges of the bonnet so that looks pretty neat and it does have a couple of exhaust pipes at the rear so that's a, a nice addition to the Porsche collection nice big rear wing at the back and a bit of a sunroof detail on the top And next up is a Volkswagen Golf GTI in yellow and white. So that looks amazing. It's got the smoked glass as well, tempered headlamps, nice chromed um, multi spoked rims. And a little bit of black wash in the grill which and the Volkswagen badge so that looks quite a nice detail So that's a nice casting. I've only got a couple of Golf GTIs. One's in blue, but I think that's from Matchbox. I haven't seen a Hot Wheels one. And next up is a 2019 Mercedes Benz A Class in a teal blue with a white stripe. That looks pretty neat. It's got a number plate detail on the back. Little Mercedes star on the tailgate. Nice Mercedes star on the front with a bit of black wash in the grill. And uh, the smoke windows all the way around. And some tempoed rear tail lamps. But that's a, a nice little casting. Then we have a Baja Blazer, a 20 Jeep Gladiator, and this looks really nice as well. It's got the motorcycles in the rear tailgate, big high raised tyres and wheels, inserted headlamps by the looks which is probably part of the windshield detail no rear tail light treatment plastic tires this also has smoked glass all the way around so it must be 
a new fashion for Hot Wheels now to have tinted glass. But that's a really nice truck. And then next up is a Ford Focus RS from their Hot Wheels Hatchback series in a powder blue. And this is a really nice casting. No rear details unfortunately, but it's got a rear roof spoiler at the back with a little Hot Wheels logo on the top. No front details, just a little bit of black wash in the lower splitter and white rimmed multi spoke wheels, plastic tyres, and again with that smoked glass all the way around. But um, there's a nice little casting this one. And then next up from their convertible series, a Corvette C6 in gloss black. And this is a real nice casting. No rear tail lamp details, but nice chromed rims. Nice Corvette logo on the front. Interior looks pretty good. And tempoed headlamps. All in all, that's a beautiful casting. And then next up from their Hot Wheels Turbo Series, a 2016 Cadillac ATS-V R in a rich burgundy colour. And that looks amazing. No tail lamp details but grey multi-spoke rims, again with the tinted glass, smoked headlamps. Cadillac uh, chrome grill and just enough little tampos just to give it a bit of extra detail and a big Cadillac badge in the middle of the grill looks really nice and I'll save the, left, less, the best one from Hot Wheels to last from their retro races in 1973 BMW 3 liter, 3 liter CSL race car. And this one looks awesome. I do like that casting. It's got uh, inserted headlamps, nice big wheels and tyres, no rear taillight details but again with the smoked glass and a single windshield wiper in the middle of the windscreen and a red lower bumper and splitter and some a bit of flared guards at the rear but all in all this is a beautiful casting.
So that's it from Hot Wheels. Next up is from Matchbox, a 2016 Alfa Romeo Giulio. In white, and this looks pretty awesome as well. I'll crack him open. It's got uh, black rimmed wheels, nice tempered headlamps, black washed grille, little alpha badge at the top of the grille, tempered rear tail lamps, a little rear deck spoiler, and tinted glass all the way around. So that looks really nice. A good pickup, that one. And then from Major F, this is a Ford GT and 163rd scale. And it's just a colour variation. It was in a plum purple. Now they've recast it in a yellow colour and it looks really nice. And that's got uh, inserted tail lamps at the back. A couple of dual exhaust mid mounted at the rear. Inserted headlamps, nice Ford badge on the front end, some side and rear mouldings, and tinted glass. And black uh, details on the front uh, grille. So that looks pretty awesome, so I'll put these in my list of favourites in order. And then also from Major Ed, a couple of Toyota Hiluxes in different colours and variations. I didn't have one last week with the big canopy on the back, so now I've got a, a red one and an orange one. No opening parts, but uh, toe hook on the back. That orange really stands out. Got nice um, chrome rims on the red one and black rims on the other one, makes it look a bit meaner. Inserted headlamps on both. Nice chrome grill with a Toyota badge. And some tow hooks at the back. So that's it for today. I'll just pop them in my order of favourites and see if you guys agree. I think that uh, BMW is an awesome casting, followed by that Cadillac in the Alfa Romeo, Ford GT, the C6 Corvette, the Ford Focus, the Porsche, Mercedes, Volkswagen, then the Hiluxes, and then the Jeep Gladiator. 
So that's how I, those ones appeal to me in that order. I do love this one. Alright, thanks very much. If you enjoyed this video, hit the thumbs up and um, share and subscribe if you like. And I'd just like to thank all of my new subscribers to the channel. I really appreciate your support and dedication to the channel. So thanks very much and I'll catch you on a future video. So bye for now.